go. Hi, this is Mike with Apple Irrigation. Today I'm going to show you how to adjust a standard alignment valley tower box, or at least the way I do it. First of all, you want to get all of the towers aligned. You want to start from the pivot point and line up the motors with the riser pipe on the pivot point. And what I do is I have somebody at the pivot point and I have somebody uh, at the tower and we'll move it till it's in line. We'll shut the switch off on the tower box. Then we'll go down and we'll move the next one. The guy at the pivot point's got to hold the safety override and move the machine forward and reverse. You keep on doing that and shutting tower boxes off as you go uh, down the line. You start from the first tower, you work your way all the way down. Now, after you have every tower perfectly aligned, you'll want to come over here to the switch that has the three wires on it. This is the forward run switch. The switch with the two wires is the safety switch. You'll want to deep cycle this switch three times, or excuse me, 30 times. Just to press this about 30 times if it's a new tower box. Then you'll want to use these adjustment screws right here to adjust the switch. Now these screws are a special screw, or excuse me, a special nut. It's a galvanized nut with a, a different kind of a thread. You'll want to loosen up the, this and then adjust these screws, or excuse me, these nuts until this forward and reverse switch is electrically centered. And what I mean by that is it's not depressed and it's not released. The safety switch will be somewhere in this groove pretty close and this switch will be electrically centered not not depressed not released so that if we put our fingers on this rod we should be able to same amount of pressure click one way and click the other way so i don't know if you can hear the click but it's a click 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 Keep on adjusting these galvanized nuts until you can get the exact same amount of pressure both ways. Now let's take a look at this cam. When you are moving this cam, look at the small amount of movement it takes to start and stop. It is just a fraction of an inch. So that's start, stop, start, stop. Another side note, if you are um, retrofitting this to a non-valley machine, you're gonna want the center of this rod to the center of this. So from here to here, you want no more than nine and a half inches, but really get it as close as you can. And you also want this rod as close as you can to the center line of this pipe. That's about it for adjusting tower boxes on a standard alignment machine. If you need irrigation parts or service and you're in western Wisconsin or southern Minnesota, shoot us an email or a text and we'll be happy to help out. Thanks for watching.